You guys know we love Toys R Us, but unfortunately they all closed. But right now, we're in Iceland, and look what we found! Toys R Us! That's still open! Let's go! Hurry! How is this possible? Guys? <laughs> We don't know what these signs mean. Are they opened? Does this mean like Monday through Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday? Today is Friday. It's 10.56, so either way, they gotta open up now. It's toys, 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 toys. Iceland's very rainy too, so they have a glass covering for the carts. Look at these carts. What? Oh, they're all locked up. So very beautiful. So is this so they don't blow away? Yeah. So we're spying inside. Look at all those toys. We're gonna be the first customers in here. Do you guys not realize you all have been closed? Oh, Johnson's here. The door's not opening. Guys, guys, guys. Go, go, go. Yes! First one's in. Which way do we go? Is this, Is this the entrance? Yeah. Yeah, you guys go first. All right, let's go. <laughs> Welcoming. Thank you. Oh, dude, this is so crazy. Me and Andrew on the way here were wondering, we're like, are they gonna have different toys here? Or are they gonna have like oh. the stereotypical like, dude, known toys? Oh, if they have like a very rare toy, maybe we should get it. Banana surprise? Oh, it's bananas. <laughs> yeah. Instantly fills up bananas with yummy flavors. Or we can use that as a challenge. Fill it up with nasty ketchup flavors. <laughs> oh yeah. Here's how you can tell like if a product's from America or not. You can tell this is specifically Icelandic because of all the different languages. Oh yeah. Most toys don't have all these that sort of thing. You saying I'm worth five point five kroners? Five thousand. Oh five thousand. Okay, okay, I keep why is this shelf empty? Because this stuff must be ultra popular here's here. Here's the deal, guys. We gotta get to the bottom of if this store is gonna be closing or not, or if this is just staying open forever. Hurry, we need to find employees. Yeah. Okay guys, we're here with some Toys R Us employees. Guys, we have a question. So in America, all of the Toys R Us are closed forever. Why is this one still open? Maybe we say a thought to some public. Maybe we say a thought. Maybe we say a thought. You say a thought. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, oh. so it's basically it's a different company that owns this store. Oh. They own like um, a few Toys R Us chains. So like oh. they they do not own the name, but they own the right to the name in uh, oh. Iceland, and also in, like Denmark and other countries. So this Toys R Us is gonna stay open. Yeah, for... this one will be. Open. <laughs> yes. We're gonna come back all the time. Yeah, we were sad because in America, we went to the, the, the very last day, the Toys R Us in our city was open. And they closed forever and we're selling all the toys and all the kids were like sad. And then we saw this and we're like, yes! But there you go guys, got some more info that if you're in Iceland, this Toys R Us is open forever. Look at this Icelandic seesaw. Imagine that in your backyard for Barrett. Did this thing break if I squished it? Well, yeah, probably, probably if we, we both sat on it, yeah, it'd probably okay, break. Maybe Barrett and Tanley should use it instead. Dude, it, it, I would totally get these for our backyard. I feel like Tenley would like love this. An art project play. Andrew, quick, build challenge. Go, 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 go. <laughs> What are you doing? I don't know. We found this is like the back employee area. Don't make Batman mad. The Duck King, he's taking over the tower. Don't worry, I got my cannon ready to fire. Three, two, one. Oh, almost. almost hit him live. Recharge. Uh, fire. Rats. Fire. You. 
I'm an Iceland Viking. Fire department, inbound. It's interesting seeing the power wheel selection here in Iceland. They have like one Audi, but mainly a bunch of off-road vehicles. That makes sense though. Yeah, and a whole bunch of tractors. Guys, did you know, we're from America, did you know all the Toys R Us in America are closed forever? Yeah, yeah, we knew. And we came yeah. here and we're so excited that you guys have one open. <laughs> yeah. This is the best. What is, does this mean run through here or? Yes. Okay, I'm gonna try and say this in Iceland. Okay. Ish. Cruiset Freya. V6 Skiapatviania. Is that right? Right. How do you guys say this? Ah, uh, uh. see, I was way off. <laughs> <laughs> there it is, that sign again. What is? Follow that sign. <laughs> oh. Oh, right. Oh yeah, I've noticed. Oh, what cool. the baby toilet? Most bathrooms have these. If you just want to lounge for a while. <laughs> <laughs> what did you find? We found a secret door up here, guys. And not only that, it's open. There's a handprint on the door, so somebody used it. What the? Oh, well. Guys, 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 what is that? What in the world? This is definitely a secret fort. Should we just go in? I don't know, what's up there? Careful up there, lad. <laughs> what? Bye. Whoa, holy cow. Where exactly are we, guys? This is the coolest fort I think I've ever seen. so cool to do a 24 hour up there guys. Full Barbie section, see what happens. All right, I'm walking in here. I'm gonna see what happens. Ken? Ken, where's your shirt? Well, nothing happened in the Barbie section, guys. I can update you on that. Lego wannabes. These aren't made here in Iceland. They're made in Denmark, but still. Nice try, guys. You I can't can beat Lego. Oh, the World Cup, Iceland football. <laughs> Guys, so we basically didn't find any forts in this store. We've been looking around this whole time, and it's definitely different than America. Yep, the Iceland Toys R Us is fort proof, unfortunately. This is the best it's gonna get. Except for that hidden door we were in. But... Yeah, that was cool. All right, next fort. <laughs> found another fort. <laughs> well, see you later. All right, it's pretty spacious in here. I do have my jacket on from Icewear and it's very hot. I'd say I could definitely fall asleep in here and if someone walked by, they had, would have no idea I'm in here. I can see out, like right here, but I really don't want to be caught by an employee. That would be awkward. They'd be like, you Americans are very weird. Where's Andrew? What was that? What? Where are you? What in the world? I literally... Oh, there you are. There's so many teddy bears in here. Is it comfy? Yes. Be so... Nap. I wish somebody would walk by and see you and be like, Whoa! Hello. Back in! <laughs> you know what would be fun? 
is to buy have a box like this at the house with this many teddy bears and buy it for for son or daughter it's like the stuffed animal playpen there's an employee over there go oh boy come on so isn't that a good idea wouldn't you want like something like this at your house a box like this and then you could just literally it's like a portal fort like a comfy portal like it's already like a building like you could build on top, you could put a blanket, you could fill it with stuffed animals like that. Can oh, put lights in here? Where can we buy these boxes? We just, yeah, we need to buy a huge box, guys, when we get home. A huge box and a whole bunch of like pity bears. Well, Andrew and I just thought, since we're never gonna be at this Toys R Us again, we have to at least buy one product that we've never seen before, like in America. So, banana, banana. surprise. Yep. Let's get it. It's not even that expensive either. 450 kroners. Is that game fun? It's not the game. It's, um, it's like this device you have here that oh. you put your banana in. Oh, and you fill it. Okay. Well, you I've have just me. enough amount. I have me some kroners. Here you are. Another reason this Toys R Us gets bonus points, they have a huge present wrapping section. This whole area is for just wrapping up toys. This is awesome. Okay guys, we just found something that is even more epic that we have never seen in any Toys R Us in America. They got these mini kid shopping carts, but right next to it, what is this? Oh, oh it's a little kid play area. Oh, okay, it's very small though. Oh, I, uh, okay. Oh, and they have a maze right here? Oh, this is so cool. Well, guys, we'd like to spend all day here, but we can't. Blast the like button right now for Toys R Us, because everybody in America, you're not going to see this again, ever. Literally, just when we thought they were closed, we find this. So let us know in the comments if you want us to go to a different country, to a different store, maybe we'll do it. Don't forget to laugh daily. And we'll see you next time. Goodbye.